Hello, I'm Maya Baptiste, a finance major from Northern Virginia, and I can't wait to show you around today. The College of Business Learning Complex is comprised of two buildings, Hartman Hall and Shoker Hall, which connect on the first, second, and third floors. We are currently in Hartman Hall, which first opened during the summer of 2020 and increased the size of the college by over 114,000 square feet. It was designed by R.A.M. Stern, a New York City firm which is known for designing the most prominent business schools across the nation. Hartman Hall is named after James and Carolyn Hartman and their family. Mr. Hartman graduated from the College of Business in 1970, serves as a trustee for the JMU Foundation, and a previous rector of the JMU Board of Visitors. The Hartmans once owned Truck Enterprises Incorporated, a large family-owned company of truck dealerships in Harrisonburg. To your right is the major innovation, collaboration, creativity, and entrepreneurship lab, which is named after Eric and Laura Parker Major in 2018. The lab is home to the Gilliam Center for Entrepreneurship, named in honor of Leslie Flannery Gilliam and her family. The center provides the opportunity for students to change the world by using business strategy and entrepreneurial thinking to solve problems. Whether you want to start your own business or bring innovation to a larger organization, you're able to do so through the GCFE. They offer programs, events, and activities to help you achieve your goals. The center is open to all JMU students, alumni, and faculty. To your left of the GCFE is the Gagliotti Capital Markets Lab, which was established in 2011 thanks to a generous gift from alumni Enrico Gagliotti. The lab is one space that received a total makeover in the construction process of the learning complex. The space is used for finance classes, has 40 computer stations, 11 Bloomberg terminals, and is also used by the student-led Madison Investment Fund. The lab also features a stock ticker and offers students access to financial software such as analytic solver and crystal ball software applications. Lakeside Cafe is the dining area within the learning complex and features the daily grind coffee shop. Breakfast, lunch, and custom beverages are served here Monday through Friday. The cafe seats 287 inside and 70 outside on the patio. Outside of dining hours, this area is available to students as study space. In the background, you can see Newman Lake. The lake covers 9.7 acres of ground and is about six feet deep. The eye-catching fountain in the middle was generously donated by the Estes Foundation. Here, you see the 2020 Visionaries listed outside of our large multifunctional room, the Forum. This wall commemorates those who provided support for the construction of the learning complex. You will notice additional plaques throughout the complex recognizing individual donors. And over here, you can see one of our new classrooms. There are 15 classrooms in Hartman Hall, with the largest room holding 100 students. However, the average class size is 26 students, and 94% of classes are taught by tenured professors. Many classrooms now have a range of technology and movable chairs, so students can engage in small group work. Hi there, my name is Libby Dickinson and I'm a senior marketing major from Annapolis, Maryland. On the Blue Ridge Promenade Mezzanine, there are 14 enclosed study areas. Students can display their own content wirelessly using the Solstice app in any study room and study rooms feature dry erase boards and display screens. These spaces are open to any student and can be used on a first come, first serve basis. The Center for Professional Sales is on the left side of the mezzanine and adds audiovisual technology to traditional in-person sales training. Hosting sales competitions throughout the year, the center also provides role play rooms and virtual interview spaces. Students have enhanced opportunities to learn alongside and network with the center's corporate partners in a dedicated space to practice the art and science of sales, develop confidence, and grow as a professional. The Advising and Support Center Suite is a centralized advising center with full-time dedicated advisors as well as Madison advising peers who are students. The ASC supports student success by providing first-year seminars, peer advising, 
academic planning, major exploration, coaching, communication tools, and partnerships with college and university-wide offices. The graphic timeline exhibited here in Choker Hall walks you through the historic turning points for the college and pays tributes to the program and individuals who helped pave the way for future generations. Founded in 1958, the college rose to a nationally recognized, fully accredited institution for business education and research in less than 30 years. Now, over 60 years later, the College of Business thrives within the learning complex. Hi, I'm Daniel Smith, a senior finance and accounting major. Welcome to the Abate Atrium inside Shoker Hall. This building is named after Zane Shoker and was originally constructed in 1992. Zane Shoker was an entrepreneur, philanthropist, and the founder and owner of Harrisonburg Fruit and Produce, which is now Cisco Food Services of Virginia. He was also a rector of the JME Board of Visitors. Shoker Hall is roughly 92,000 square feet and houses 21 classrooms. This building houses most faculty offices on the upper levels and features additional student study spaces like the KPMG Engaged Learning Zone to your left and the Rabibo Quiet Study Room on the second floor. This is the Deloitte Foundation Global Studies Suite, a space dedicated to our international business program and the global supply chain management minor. The suite is used for informational meetings about study abroad opportunities, including the Cobb 300 semester in Antwerp, Belgium. While abroad, students attend classes at the University of Antwerp with business faculty who specialize in European integration and the effects of economic and monetary union. We also have a dedicated space for College of Business student organizations, clubs, and honor societies to meet and work. You can get involved in any number of the nearly 25 groups we have to develop your leadership skills. The new Digital Marketing Lab is an enriched learning environment that allows small groups of students to work in teams while providing the professor the ability to share their work to a large central display. This extends the collective learning experience for the entire class. The Agile workstations promote active learning by allowing students to work simultaneously on interrelated portions of the same digital project. You are now standing on the Hartman Hall back patio. From here, you can see Bridge Force Stadium and get a stunning view of Newman Lake on a nice day. This is another example of a space dedicated to our students and their well-being. We are almost at the end of our tour. On your right is the Barrel MBA Suite. The College of Business offers an MBA program with three possible concentrations, Executive Leadership, Information Security, and Innovation. The EY Suite on your left is home to the Office of Professional Development and Engagement. It features an employer space where recruiters can host information tables to interact with College of Business students. Our young alumni often find themselves back here excited to engage with current students. Students can also reserve virtual interview rooms inside the suite as well as changing rooms to slip into their professional business attire. This marks the conclusion of the College of Business Learning Complex Tour. We hope to see you on campus soon. 